coverage you can count on begins with quite a crowd this morning at Thurman Dam. The Army Corps of Engineers opening the spillway gates. Hannah Latier shows us why it's such a big attraction. Hundreds of thousands of gallons of water are pouring out of the dam behind me every second. This is our emergency spillway, so we only operate it when we're in flood conditions. This is something the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers has been doing since the dam was constructed about 60 years ago. Oh. Flood conditions have only happened six times in the 60-year history of this of this dam, so they're, they're few and far between. It's a way for them to be prepared if they need to let out excess water out of the 23 gates in the event of a flood and to test for any mechanical issues. They open each gate in three to five minute intervals. We're opening them two feet, so once we have all 23 gates open, we'll be letting out about 50,000 cubic feet per second of water. That's the equivalent of just, just below 400,000 gallons per second. People who came out to watch tell us that it's something everyone should see at least once. So that we came earlier this year for just an educational purposes to let them see how the dam looked and what it did. And so when we saw that it was going to be testing today, we just brought them back to see how it actually worked. Is it crazy seeing it now compared to when y'all saw it before? There's no water coming out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We heard about this and we got up about seven o'clock this morning and this is my first dam release. So we come down here and we're real excited. I've never seen one before and it's really cool. Staff says that this is something that they would like to do annually, depending on water levels and other maintenance priorities, and they're looking forward to doing it again next year. In Clarks Hill, Hannah Latier, WJBF News Channel 6.